Hey you guys, my name is Brittany and welcome back to my YouTube channel. You guys, in today's video, I am going to be sharing what I got my three girls for Christmas. So if any of you guys are new here to my channel, again, my name is Brittany. I am a mom to three. I have three girls who are 12, five, and three. And I am officially completed with my Christmas shopping and I'm so excited to share with you guys what I got my three girls for Christmas. So over here, I definitely have a very girly, girly household. <laughs> I'm talking about the dolls, the Barbies, the everything. So that is all you are primarily gonna see, especially because my younger two, my three and my five-year-old, they really piggyback on each other and they like some similar things but then some different things. So um, I'm really, really excited. The hardest person that I had to shop for this year was my 12-year-old because I officially have like a preteen. So it's like we're in the in between phase where she still wants like some toys still but then also too I do want to uh, get her some things as she is evolving into like a preteen and some of her new interests and her new hobbies so she was a little bit harder for me to shop but I think I really had uh, did a good balance with my 12 year old as far as that goes so since we're talking about my 12 year old I think we're gonna start off with her so one of her big gifts that's gonna be sitting under the table, you kind of see them all around, are like these big squishmallows. I got these right here from um, Costco's. So they were on sale for $11.99, so I grabbed three of them. So this one is hers because it has some of her favorite colors in it. So another one of her big gifts that I got her was this uh, big jewelry design set. It has like all the different things that she can do as far as like building her own jewelry kit. And this was at Costco's too when I was uh, going shopping and she definitely loves like tinkering and making. Last year I got her the little rubber band jewelry making set. You guys, she made bracelets all year long. So I definitely think she's going to enjoy uh, making more jewelry this year. And uh, this is a huge box if you can tell. So these are like her big gifts that are gonna be under the tree. Now the next thing that I got her is because she definitely loves books. I wanted to at least get her one book. I buy her books all year round, but I know she's gonna be excited to at least have one under the Christmas tree. So I picked up this book, it's called Ellie Engel Saves the World and it has crossed out the world and it says herself. So I read the reviews, this seems like a great book, so hopefully she will enjoy having a new book under the Christmas tree. Now, something else that I got her, this was actually one of the only things she really asked for, which is new paint marker. She is my artistic girl. She loves painting, crafting, as you guys can kind of see from her gifts. So I just got her a new set of paint markers and I typically grab mine from Five Below and they're so affordable. She has like all the colors and she goes through a pack a year, which isn't that bad. So these are her new paint markers she asked for. Now something cute that I seen when I was at the store was this cute like nostalgic pencil case and I got this for her and hopefully she will enjoy this putting her like own supplies and things like that in there and I definitely remember having one of these so hopefully uh, my 12 year old will enjoy uh, having her own like special pencil case and when I seen this one I definitely had to grab it really for like nostalgic purposes for her. Something else that I picked up for her was this photo clip string light so she can string the lights in her room and add pictures to it. I really wanted to get her one of those like uh, instant Polaroid uh, cameras. It really wasn't in the budget this year for us to get it. Hopefully we can get that for her soon because she loves taking pictures. But I figured I can get this right here for her and then we can go like to CVS or Walgreens and print off her pictures. She can sit at the like little kiosk and it still will be something fun and we can go at least once a month for her to be able to change out all of her pictures and uh, string it in her room. So I had to snag this one from Amazon. It was really, really affordable. I think this was only 10 bucks. Now, as far as like, I guess that spa, you know, self-care type of things for uh, my preteen, I got her this big jumbo set of nail polish because she's painting her nails. I mean, hey, I need to get her to start painting her mama's nails because she's getting really, really good painting, doing designs and things like that. So I thought she definitely will enjoy this big set of uh, brand new nail polish. Now, something else that I grabbed her was some lip gloss. 
and some scrunchies and also a little head wrap when she's like uh, doing her skincare routine like in the bathroom so this is like her personal care type of things and what I'll probably do is like for this right here I'll probably put these all together in one box for one gift for her um something else that I got her even though she does have the jewelry making kit I grabbed her a couple of more like fun pieces of jewelry that I found at five below and hopefully she will enjoy these as well these I may put in her stocking but that's what I got her um along with that I got her a calendar from five below I had to grab this one she loves getting a new calendar every year since we're in December she definitely loves putting her new one up at the new year and this is a cute hello kitty one so those are kind of like her preteen gifts now I still get, did get her some toys because she still likes toys um it was so crazy last year she uh didn't want to play with her Barbie dream house and I put it in the basement and then she asked me earlier uh this year to bring it back upstairs and she's like been back playing with Barbies I was playing with Barbies you guys until I think I was like 13 and then after that point I started just collecting them in my room because I really still love dolls for a long time and she seems to be following after her mom so I grabbed these two cute Barbies that I seen I think I got these from Burlington and Ross when I was just in there randomly and they were only $9.99 so I had to snag these two fashion girls they're so cute um, I also grabbed her uh, lol tween doll isn't she cute you guys and then I just grabbed her some more like little uh, discounted Barbies that I seen down there uh, some of her favorites so that's everything that I got my uh, 12 year old now you guys let's go into my five-year-old next and her big gift is this big <laughs> cute little lol doll house she definitely has been into like lol dolls they have been really really enjoying watching the movie and I think she's gonna enjoy this one it actually comes with one so this is a cute little set so that is like her big gift she also has a Squishmallow <laughs> that I'm going to sit underneath of the Christmas tree. And I think it's going to be so, so, so cute. So that is like her two big gifts that's going to be downstairs in like underneath the Christmas tree. I also got my five-year-old a set of Legos. We actually joined a homeschool Lego club uh, for the kiddos at the library. And um, my five-year-old, from this point on, she was really only using like the Lego Duplos. And when we went to Lego STEM club, she really, really enjoyed the classic ones. So I went ahead and I grabbed her her own set so she can start tinkering and doing things like this at home. And she doesn't have to wait until we go to the Lego club to be able to do this. So I had a snack this and on holiday times these uh, classic Legos are always on sale so I think she's going to enjoy having her own set at home so I also got her these cute little Barbie shoes and uh, tiaras that I seen at the store um, they uh, love playing dress up my younger two so I definitely think she needed like more shoes and things like that of course they have like the tutus and all that stuff so she just needed like shoes and crowns and things like that so I got that for her I also picked her up uh, some more Barbies. They all got like more Barbies to add to their collection. So I just grabbed three random ones that I thought that she would enjoy. So I'll probably like again wrap these all up in like one gift. I got her this cute little uh, Gabby dollhouse. It's like a little journal and sticker book with a pen. You guys, it was only $2.79 and I had to grab this up and I think she'll enjoy it, especially now she's in kindergarten. She's learning how to write letters and numbers and she, I always find her sketching and doing things. I think she'll enjoy having like her own little Gabby dollhouse um, actual journal. And the last thing that I got her was this little teeny uh, Barbie extra mini. Um, it's kind of like a little Chelsea doll and hopefully she will enjoy that. So that is everything that I got my five-year-old. Now we're going to go into baby girl. She is three years old and I'm going to share with you guys everything I got her. But let me move some of this stuff out the way. It's so crazy. It's like when you are Christmas shopping, you don't see everything all at once. And when I make these videos and I see all of like the Christmas stuff all at once, it's like... I'm like, okay, I'm so happy that I stopped Christmas shopping because I had more than I thought. So <laughs> yeah, so as far as baby girl, her thing that she's going to have underneath of the tree is her Squishmallow. And this one definitely matches her personality and hopefully she will enjoy this one. 
So her big gift that I got her is a Gabby doll house. She loves Gabby's world. We watch it every single morning before she kickstarts her day. And I definitely hope she will enjoy this. You guys got to lean back to get the whole thing in a frame. But um, I really, really um, am happy that we were able to grab this one for her. So this is her Gabby doll house. The next thing that I got, um, my three-year-old, she still loves baby dolls and she's been eyeing a baby alive. So I finally got her her own baby alive with like the food and a diaper and everything like that. So hopefully she will enjoy this one. So this is another like big gift that I got her. Now I did get my younger two a shared gift because I didn't know if I was going to get the LOL um, doll house at first. So I just got them this cute little LOL doll camper. So I'm just going to have my younger two share this gift and this will be like a share gift even though for the most part they share all their toys. So um, I thought this little camper was cute. So my three year old also has her own pair of tiaras and slippers as well. And I got her also some Gabby doll house like the actual figurines to go with a big doll house because I don't think it comes with anything but the furniture. So now she actually has like all the like figurines and things like that in, in it as well. I got her a few Barbies as well. She really, really enjoys the uh, Disney Princess Barbie. So um, I just snagged her some Disney Princess Barbies uh, so they all can have some. So she has Ariel, she has Tangled, or what's her name, uh, Rapunzel, she has uh, Aurora, and then she also has Belle. The only one that I wanted to get her as well, and hopefully I can just go snag it up, is I wanted to also get her the live action Little Mermaid one as well, so she can have like all of the princesses, because she doesn't have any Barbies. My older two, they actually, you know, have more than her because they've been collecting longer than she has, so I got her a few more so she can start building up her own little collection and especially since she loves like the Disney princesses I definitely think she will really really enjoy having like her own Barbies as well so you guys this is everything that I got my 12 5 and 3 year old for Christmas I really hope that they are surprised this Christmas and I really hope that they enjoy all of their gifts um, my kiddos you guys they get things all throughout the year and this is just another time that I really enjoy spoiling them and um, I know that they are going to enjoy and appreciate all the effort that me and my husband put this Christmas season for them so you guys I really hope you are enjoying your Christmas and your holiday season. I really hope you're finding good deals this uh, Christmas season. I know things are a little bit tight for us all, but just continue to shop out there. Look for discounts, look for deals. Don't break the bank this budget or this home or this Christmas uh, year. It's definitely not worth it. Um, this season, um, while I'm happy that we were able to get our kids things, this season is really about family and in our advent time and i definitely keep that at the center of our home this is just the fun and the extra so you guys thank you so much for watching today's video and as always i look forward to seeing everybody in my next one bye